everybody. Welcome back to Tub Time, the little segment from here in Omaha where we like to have a little fun in the tub here at Rebath. I uh, wanted to talk to you today about how long is too long. Uh, people love to take a nice soothing soak in the tub, but uh, how long should you actually be staying in the tub? Uh, that's a question that you know a lot of people wonder but probably don't ask. Uh, so here are some uh, ideas about that and what uh, provide, uh, different tub companies would say, especially for the jetted tubs versus a regular tub such as this one. So if you have a jetted tub or a hot tub or any type of uh, hydro massage, air massage kind of tub, these tubs, it is recommended that you spend uh, about 15, 10 to 15 minutes uh, for a good soak in that kind of tub and they do not recommend that you spend over 45 minutes now the reason for that is because those types of tubs do produ produce uh, help with circulation and when you are in them for too long there's risk of high blood pressure uh, and those types of things so uh, we, we just highly advise that you adhere to the manufacturer's recommendations to 10 to 15 minutes and no more than 45 unless you get out and then get back in and then it's the time starts over again so now for regular tubs such as these actually you can spend too much time in the tub uh, you know that little uh, when your fingers get all pruney and they start looking real wrinkly that's actually your body's response to you spending excess time in the water. And it's not your body absorbing water, it's actually air bubbles forming between the two layers of skin, the epidermis and the dermis. Uh, when those air bubbles form, it makes the skin have that wrinkly appearance. And that's kind of an evolutionary mechanism so that uh, human beings can grab onto things uh, when their hands are wet and grab onto wet surfaces. Uh, a little fun fact for you, a little fun in the tub, but it doesn't mean that you're absorbing water. In fact, actually, the longer you stay in the water, those little air bubbles between the dermis and the epidermis, uh, with prolonged water, they will actually pop. And it's like a blister of sorts, so that's when you can start getting skin breakdown, skin infections, and those types of things. In fact, uh, I was reading an article online from uh, a uh, dermatologist from Florida that said that uh, prolonged prolong, um, water exposure, uh, tub, pool, ocean, lake, whatever, um, can actually cause your skin to break down and over time can fall off. So, how much time is too long in the tub? Probably that same 45 minute rule. After about 45 minutes, you probably should get out of the tub, let your body acclimate to being dry, and then if you need to take a second bath for more relaxation or just more fun in the tub, you can go ahead and do that. But, um, so, how long is too long? A little over 45 minutes is probably too long to be in the water. If you ever need any more, um, quick tips about having some fun in the tub. Join me next week. We'll be talking about a whole nother topic. And until then, have a great day.